Hey what's up everybody it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks and today I'm going to show you how to install Cyan and Jamad's gallery app on any Android Lollipop device. Now Cyan and Jamad has been building upon standard open source Android apps for years now. They've made improvements to apps like the stock SMS client, the stock audio mixer and a whole slew of others. More recently with Cyanogemod 12, they've given the AOSP Gallery app a nice material design makeover with a few usability improvements. Usually this Gallery app would be exclusive to devices that are running CM12, but developer Brad Ling has made it available to any device running Android Lollipop. To be a bit more specific, the app itself should work on any Lollipop device, but in order to use the photo editing features, you'll need to have an ARMv7 processor. I'd say that's roughly 95% of all Android phones and tablets though, so odds are if you're running Lollipop, you can use all features of this app. And this doesn't require root or any special permissions either. The only thing you'll need to do is enable unknown sources in your phone's settings under security. Then to get started, head to my full tutorial on Gadget Hacks to download a copy of the APK installer file. And once you have the file saved to your device, go ahead and tap the download complete notification to launch it. From here, review the app's permissions and press install. Then when that's finished, tap open. Now this is an easy to use interface if I ever saw one. The main screen here shows all of the photo folders on your device. But if you tap the drop menu in the top left corner, you can sort this list by location, times, people and tags instead. From here, viewing a photo is as simple as selecting the album or source folder, then tapping the thumbnail. Then if you want to edit this photo, Tap the floating action button in the bottom right corner. This gives you access to plenty of filters, frames and image tweaking options. So it's a very capable photo editor. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time folks, but until then, happy gadget hacking.